uh, in my class when students clap, I know it's time to close. <laughs> Good afternoon, everyone. As Professor Sarsrabhade said, today, 9th of August, is also remembered as a Kranti day for our freedom fighters who fought for the freedom of the country in the past. <coughs> Today is, yeah, yeah, story will come. <laughs> Today is also Eid and uh, our Shah Rukh, Dr. Agashe, So, our Sharu, Dr. Agashi, has launched the Eagle Express. So, this Eagle Express is not only tax free for our students, there is no entry fee also. You have 64 hours of fun, as I am told. No examination. And still a certification at the end of those 64 hours. I wish I could become a part of the student gathering and learn through this program. Dignitaries on the dais, our chief guest, Mr. Shamal Gupta, special advisor, Tata International Limited, Mr. Sanjay Kirloskar, Mr. Sharad Ganga, Mr. Ujwal Balanji, Mr. Tavzir Dadina, Mr. Dhananjay Savarkar, Ms. Kamal Rukbarya, our dear director, Prof. Sastra Buddha, Asharud, Dr. Agashe. <laughs> Invited dignitaries, my colleagues, dear friends, Ladies and gentlemen, this journey of uh, eagle and eaglets has been truly amazing. And uh, today we have witnessed the launch of our eagle program <coughs> Sorry. at the hands of the great ones who are committed to the student community. A big round of applause for our Dignitaries on the dais, off the dais. <laughs> Normally, you know, I uh, am given a slot at the beginning. Whenever we have such occasions, I have given a slot at the beginning. And uh, then as you know, when you give an audience to a teacher, he doesn't stop and uh, so they realize that I have always been taking too much of my time. So this time, this time they decided to give me just five minutes before lunch. <laughs> so I take this opportunity to thank Mr. Shamal Gupta of whom we learned and heard of today, a little while ago, a visionary himself, a great benefactor of humanity, a person of radiant simplicity and humility. When he came in, he said, I don't want to be introduced. 
I will just speak to the students and the audience. We have such a dignified personality amongst us. And I thank him for conceiving this idea and energizing it by his presence this morning. And we are happy that we were enlightened with his thoughts and words of wisdom. Thank you, sir, for being here with us this morning. Uh, I also take this opportunity to express uh, our gratitude to Mr. Pradeep Bhargava, Director Cummins, and Mrs. Rati Forbes, uh, Director Forbes Marshall, who have helped us in more than one ways to launch this program. They were like uh, two wings of the eagle, spearheading the lead for sponsorships and painstakingly taking us from one contact to another to raise funds, to get more sponsorship, to rope in more industries, to get more support for this program. Uh, we must thank them as well for uh, being there for us. So big round of applause for them as well. My dear friend. The purpose of this EGLE program, as we heard a little while ago, is to equip our students with attitudes, with soft skills, with life learning skills, with work culture, so that our students are able to take up challenges much ahead of their time. And to make this happen, uh, we had Mr. Mangesh Kulkarni, we have with us Mr. Mangesh Kulkarni here, uh, Vice President HR from Piaggio Limited, and Mr. Bobby Kuriakos, he's head HR Forbes Marshal. Uh, and they were there to enrich the program contents of this uh, Eagle program that we are going to undertake. Uh, they took time out of their schedules and they helped us to design the course content and to make this course uh, truly uh, a one which is meant for students as a life learning course rather than uh, career learning. Uh, they provided us the much needed guidance and hand holding to see that our students qualify for every purpose in life. Uh, sirs, thank you very much for being there for us, Mr. Uh, Kulkarni and Mr. Bobby Kuriakos. Round of applause for them. Uh, now comes the story part. Well, uh, this is for our sponsors. This story I read as a small child which is still there very much in my mind today. Uh, this is a story of a school grader, a third grade student from class three uh, in a school in Chicago. This is a true story. And uh, it was nearing Christmas time and these children from the smaller class were asked to put up a Christmas pageant uh, for their teachers and the remaining students. And so this third grade student, th third grader, uh, was asked to perform the role of an uh, innkeeper. And all he had to do was just mention one line in that play, was, sorry, there is no room in the inn today. All he had to say was one line in that whole enactment that was done uh, prior to Christmas, two days, three days prior to Christmas, was just to say, sorry, there is no room at the inn today. And he was playing the role of an innkeeper. So he rehearsed, he practiced very well. And uh, when the day this enactment uh, was to happen, uh, he was very much emotionally charged up and uh, with full enthusiasm and feeling, you know, when Mary and Joseph come to the inn, so as an innkeeper, he tells them, sorry, Mary and Joseph, uh, there is no room today. There is no room in the inn, at the inn today. And uh, what was happened, what was to happen next was that Mary and Joseph would turn around and go back. And as they turned around and went back, the spirit of Christmas got better of this student, of this small child. And he called back, which was not a part of the play, and he called back and he said, 
Mary, Joseph, please come back, please come back. I have room at my room. I have room at my room. Please come and stay with me. So at the enactment, he was to say, no, there is no room. But he was so charged up that he said, no, there is room at my room. Please come and stay with me. So this is what our sponsors have done. When the industry is not doing so very well, they said we have room for CIP students. They said, we, we not only have the room, we have the space. They gave us their warmth and concern. And they packaged this little hamper of warmth and concern and laced it with sponsorship amounts. Thanks to them that we are able to run this program today. We would like to take this opportunity to thank Kirloskar Brothers Limited, Tata Consulting Engineers, KND Engineering, Tata Trust, Thermax, and many others who are here with us for helping us to make this happen for our students. For these industry sponsors, it was like a connect with no connect. Connect with no connect. They wanted to be connected because they cared for our students. They wanted to do something for our students. And there was no connect because none of them are sure that after undergoing through, through this program, whether you will ever be a part of their organization. Still they said, no, we will come forward and support this cause and help students for CVP. So they were passionate about doing something for CVP students. We are very grateful to them that they have come forward and would do so much for our institute. What may I say of Ms. Kamal Bhalia, Kamal Rup Bhalia. She talked of Abu Ben Adam, but she, and she said then there was this angel, this divine light, which came to Abu Ben Adam and then told him that God loves him and he's on the top list. But may I tell you, my friend, she is the divine angel for COEP. A person of dedicated determination and unflinching perseverance and patience. Like the claws of the eagle, she held us together and she said, she and her team, she said, we will do it for CUA. Thank you, ma'am, for being there for CUAP and for doing it for our students. Before I conclude and thank everyone, as our gesture of goodwill and gratitude to all those here who have made it for CUAP today, for all of you today. I would request all of our dear students to stand up. I would request all of our students to stand up and repeat these words which I am going to say to express our gratitude and thank you to the dignitaries on and off the dais. I'm going to say this and I want you to repeat this. A big thank you for all of them. Thank you all. Where would be without you? Thank you. Please sit down. Uh, Ms. Kamal Rupbaria said that there is going to be inauguration and then there is going to be induction. So between inauguration and induction, you have a break, a munch break, a brunch break, a lunch break. Come back after the break. Thank you.